Hey Seth here, Max, and welcome back to another video. Today I have a quick tip for you guys, how to make a percentage counter in After Effects. So this is going to be really quick, so just bear with me. So create a new composition, and I'll make it 5 seconds. Click OK. I'm going to create a new solid. It's going to be this light gray. So next we're going to create a text layer. Click over here, and let's just uh, type in 0. You can actually type in whatever you want, uh, but I'll just type in 0. So center the anchor point and center the layer. Now let's just make this bigger because it's kind of hard to see. So next what we're going to do is twirl down here, go into the text options, hit alt and click on the source text keyframe. And what we're going to do is go in here, this arrow, click on JavaScript math and click on math.round value. So we're going to click out. Next, what we're going to do is go into our effects and presets, search in slider control. We're going to drag that onto our text layer. Just drag down there. And uh, if you want, you can rename it. I'll just call it um, uh, counter. Okay, so we'll go back in here and we'll just select the value part, nothing else, just the value part. Uh, yep. And what we're going to do is take this pick whip, drag it all the way to the slider, and we're just going to click out. So what, we're, what, what this will do is whatever we change in this slider, we can change the value. That will change the uh, number in the text layer because we've linked this counter to the, the text layer. So this is all good. We can just keyframe it like that and be done with it, right? Well, kind of. You can, if you want, you can just make this like that. But if you want to add a percentage sign, you can. You can either just like take uh, like add a separate text layer and just animate the position of the text layer to go along with how however this moves. But that will take kind of a long time. So what we can actually do is add to this expression. We can just go uh, to the end, type in plus, and we can just uh, put quotation marks. Uh, and percentage sign and quotation marks and we can just click off now we'll just uh, have the percentage sign but it's not limited to that you can just you can actually add anything you want so you can even say zero person completed so let me actually scale this down a little, a little bit there we go so you can actually do that zero person completed 30% completed, 40, 50, 60. You can do all that stuff. So I'm going to leave it here. You guys can experiment with this and figure out a lot more stuff than I need to do. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe.